A crime alert now. Several trees have been poisoned throughout Santa Maria. While the city investigates, News Channel reporter Patricia Martellotti found out what a local arborist knows about the vandalism so far. So you can see here that the tree was uh, used some type of tool to get to the to the inner part of the tree and the injection hole and there's some type of substance that was injected inside the tree. That substance is now killing trees near West Main Street in Santa Maria. So you can see this tree here, the, the icy blue, and it's, it's starting to die back. Santa Maria City Arborist Roy Teniente says these two trees, which were planted next to each other, are dying at the same time. Based on the holes that were drilled in both of them, he says they were most likely poisoned intentionally. Investigators are still trying to figure out why it happened but they have a theory. Remove a tree, you know, this one does have the fruit on it. It does cause a mass, but again, we try to address that, you know, by trimming. Crews say just to replace this icy blue tree of this size will cost the city more than $3,000. Another tree is dying on Taft Street. I saw them, they look pretty dead. Yeah, you know, it's, it's unfortunate for sure. The city's going to be conducting a full investigation with code enforcement leading the effort. And, uh, you know, we intend to hold those that are we're, you know, involved or, you know, accountable um, to make sure that, uh, you know, we prevent this from happening again. The city says whoever poisoned the tree could face a fine and have to pay for the tree. In Santa Maria, I'm News Channel reporter Patricia Martellotti.